Onivia, League of Legends highlights. Should be very, very um, aggressive. Kale is a good gangplank answer. Has a very fast resetting auto attack to last hit barrels and beat him at that game. Mm -hmm. He doesn't bully her. Uh, scare tactics coming out of the brush. Surprise. Yeah. Dragon will be picked up by them, though, of course. Uh, as a jungler, you also just never want to. Wow. It goes right back wow, in. We, we actually had the red color selected here on the. Yeah, that was right. good. Well done. We, we rarely use that one. Yeah, but use it correctly in this case. Fudge going to burn his flash. Will not be in range for a second barrel. Hits for some move speed. And there goes Turret off. Ulti, prevent a safety there as well. Going to just press every button possible. A lot of R's. And that's going to make the pirate pretty happy. We're going to get the shield. But Jensen's in the way. Flash into the chain. That should be a kill. That'll hand over the assist to his top laner. Thank you very much, Fudge. 100 the gold richer, first blow for the Gitas, but turned around. I know that feel as Volibear too. He's just like, I gotta make an early play. Gamsudo now, red buff burn. Minions, no, the W, and Jensen gets his second. Welcome back to the summer split. Who, who was talking last week? Flashes early to get the flash out of Fudge. Turns off the turret during the duration of this Kale ultimate. Then Gamsu also flashes to make sure they get it. They wouldn't have seen there's any action up in the top side. Could try to stealth you. If Gumsy ever went for anything roughly melee range, even an aggressive fire, he's gonna flash for it. Actually, really goes for the play. No flash on GP means there is no way out. Hand him the kill! Flavor could have turned off our hand into the money, but it's still gonna go over 300 to the jungler, 150 to the top lane. You get hit level 11 when you finish your Ludens and pick up a Dark Seal. Oh, that's a flash stun. That's Tom Kench, the target, which means he cannot save someone else. Then, very tanky, stand alive for 100 HP. Flashes, Ignite is on. How many ticks are left? Not enough. Neo gonna be knocked into the air, chasing him down. Flavor's gonna find him, and now, out of reserve. Gets chopped oh, up, River in with the ulti, gets one, looks for two, but it's a really big shield. Do they have enough damage in time? They can turn back for the turn if they wanted to. The minions are there, gonna dive in for more. Blue shows up, but it's gonna be knocked down by River. Turret's gonna fall likely as well. Blabber left yeah. alone, easy auto. Make sure he's not in range yet of Blue. And now with the clone, they know where he is. They see him through the stealth. Biofrost low, jumps Ooh, on. Blabber you. takes him down. Rest of damage should be there, and indeed it will happen. Five to four scoreline, and here comes Jensen, the clock is ticking. Big Benson here to knock you down. Is it gonna be enough? He's on a ward. Gonna find a bit of damage. There's a stun. He's gotta be careful. Jumps back over, finds a blast plant. Doesn't even need it, gets away. <laughs> yes, my job here is done. Oh. Oh, 3k health. Maybe they can't even burn it. Blabber trying to they burn try. it. River has ulti, has smite, can walk in. Will it's he get fight. it? It's going to be the turn back for the battle right now. No smite actually up on Blabber. He can't go for the play. He actually smited a scuttle earlier. Typical Blabber behavior has to turn away. Ignite is on now. Gets chomped up by Zven. He's going to oh be fine. God. But now they might get it anyway. They're going to burn it down. Yes, indeed. Claimed. And there we go. Jensen. Smite They're literally trying to burn <laughs> down a dragon with all of Dig right next to them. Uh, and they still get it! Cloud9, um, able to sit sidelines forever and gain tons of XP. Jen's actually ahead of him in experience, so Fudge grouped a little early. Level 11 kills, fine. She's a real timing, baby. Slow mo. Shelly's going for it. She's gonna get it. Oh, yoink. It, it was W. It was the W, baby. Because <laughs> W's. It, okay, never mind. It was a W. He got the, he got exactly. the kill. Yeah, it's a, it's a fat dub. Bios looking for his first on the split, though. River on the way forward. That will be a stun. Ooh, aims to slow really well, forcing the flash out of Jensen. Oh, it's gonna land. Senna for the shield. Not gonna be in time. Kill comes over. Three assists across the squad. Neo, that's yours. You you deserve that. Okay, okay. Here we come. Teleport's arriving. Everybody's showing up to the big party. Yeah, we got 5,000 health left on the Ocean Drake, and it's got to be Dignitas there, but to walk in. River, not the best engaged. Blabber on the plate. Oh, They're going to try to get away. Great shuffle. That was perfect. It pushes away the Kale nuke, and now, oh, man, Blue is in towards Fudge. 500 health. Not a lot of escape tools left as well. 2K. Going to be claimed. Neo gets it again. The quick chop. Tom Kench saves one. A flash of safety, Sven. Everyone's going to be alive for now. Really, really dangerous here, but no one dies except that port. Partial to things like Riley's, where you Burning. can just kind of keep them in the same spot for a while. Not a huge deal regardless, but they do want to make sure they can cut through the front line. And looking now at a bit more here. River wants to jump in, finds his stun. They're going to get a bit of damage towards Ben. We'll get the shield stays alive for now. Bolivar's still over the top. They're going to try to burn through both health bars, and they do. And going in for a bit more now. Blabber doesn't have a good way out. River pretty tanky. If the shield again sidesteps, and a double kill comes through for Gamsu, and that should be the freest fair and setup. Load up the dignity. A miracle for them to steal this. Where's the magic now? They're gonna try. Jensen, can you get the spells? Getting poked out by Blue, gets the passive popped as well. Be careful, buddy. The clone has gone, ties him with Kale Ult. Is it gonna be enough damage delivered? A shuffle back for Blue. They're gonna stay up there and take the fight. Berserker's down. A triple so kill for Blue. Even the Baron belongs to Dignitas. Dignitas inside that Cloud9 base very quickly. 
There goes another turret. So gold lead definitely resoundingly in Nikodas' favor right now. Red Bull Baron power play looking pretty solid here with a 4,000 gold lead. The fifth dragon of the game spawn and looking now at the inhibitor turret itself. Not what? too far away. Here comes the first dive. A shuttle back again. Brings him to safety. That engage oh. is not good enough. Not yet turning out the tower as uh, River Zulti is down. It doesn't get much done with it. So uh, still some wave clear. Gamsu walks in, walks out. River a little bit low. Has some shielding, has some healing. Turret getting lower and lower. Zven's force to flash to safety. There goes the tower. Now the inhibitor is going to be claimed. You got to walk away from that one. Cloud9, they can't go for much more here. But actually, they want to play now. They think Hellforth low enough that a TP play might just work. Jensen's in, gets marked. Slowed down as the Cerildos applies the slogan sort of the teleport move speed. Jensen again delivers Kale damage, but it's not going to be enough. They may have practiced the combo. The combo might get them kill one and two, actually. They're going to leave River out to dry. Then it's going to be a riverbed, and they're going to pick up the pebbles now. Three versus oh, five. Jensen! Nearly enough damage, but no, not going to find that kill. And turns out Dignitas greeting for the inhibitor means they will drop more money. Trying to find Neo. Find some little Kruggies. Yep, Flash. That's why I like Riley. Now on in this game, though it slightly regens up until that point. Gonna be finding top tier two. Can they get the zero summon in time? Because Blabber wants to flank. He is known. They have a control with what's going on. They need the turret. That will make the fight very hard to win for Cloud9, as long as they can live a little bit. It's gonna do extra damage of sixth member. So does Pit. Be careful because Cloud9 are aware. TP is up for fight. They're gonna meet right here. They know something's up. Is it gonna matter? Blabber in the front line. Ults onto all four. One's double coming in. Finally get a little bit of something, but here comes the dive in for Tom Kench. So I'm gonna do some damage. Stopwatch burn for a second as the turret falls to the top side. River is low. Ults to safety. You never want to see that. Blabber's in for blood and he finds some. It's gonna be blood in the water. They're looking for one. They're going for two. Nice bubble by some time. They're gonna go for a bit more. They're gonna get the chomp. Azir oh, will be digested. Chomps him up. Blabber dives in for a bit more. Gamsu is low. Barrels will land for some damage, but the shutdown comes through for Fudge. River's got to hide away. Now, this is going to be a death. He's going to drop. Now, shield for a moment. Jensen, does he have it? Ah, with the heal, he's going to be okay. Maybe not. <laughs> he's not done yet. All right, Cloud9. Are they going to try and push all the way to Nexus Turrets? I think they need to Baron instead. Just probably take a little bit of towers and then go back for the Baron before Dignitas revive. Death timer's already coming up pretty quickly here. They're going to opt for an inhibitor push. Ken on Lucian. 20 on Azir, 23 on Gangplank. They're posturing for Nexus in a five versus two. Azir still be 15 soon. seconds away. They're gonna have Lucian. Will it be enough to the front line just evaporating? River dies right away. Still a 5v2. Sven pretty tanky. Second turret falls. Oh, they did. Cloud9 look for their first win of the split, and they're gonna get it. The new roster and a slobber knocker is undefeated. They're not messing around, no hesitation there. Push straight through to the Nexus.